7, Jonathan Young. Thank you, Mr Speaker. My question is to the Acting Minister of Energy and Resources and asks... Order. What? Order. I've called Jonathan Young. Uh, to the Acting Minister of Energy and Resources and asks, what is Petrobras able to do under the permit granted to it in the Rokumara Basin? Honourable Hekia Parata. Uh, Mr Speaker, under the five-year permit, Petrobras can acquire and interpret 2D and 3D seismic data and is consented to drill one exploratory well. At the end of the five-year period, if Petrobras wishes to move on to extraction and production, a petroleum mining permit will need to be applied for. Jonathan Young. What activities have previously been undertaken in petroleum exploration and production in New Zealand? The Honourable Heke Parata. Mr Speaker, New Zealand has a long history of petroleum exploration and production dating back to 1864. In 2010, 18 seismic surveys were undertaken in New Zealand and 59 exploration and development wells were also drilled. What this demonstrates is that petroleum activity is currently carried out regularly in New Zealand in a responsible manner. Petroleum is New Zealand's fourth largest export earner. Last year it brought in $2.1 billion in revenue and directly and indirectly employed over 7,000 people. The government is committed to wealth creating opportunities, including the potential in New Zealand's petroleum and mineral resources. Question number eight, David Clem.